What's good, YouTube? Bitch, so money insane. You already know the vibes. You feel me? We back with another reaction. So, yeah, yo, everybody know, you know what I'm saying? Remy, my son got in a little situation, a little situation. Actually, a big situation. My son is indicted right now. You feel me? Um, I think it was murder. I could, I, If I'm wrong, y'all can let me know in the comment section. I've been gone for a little while, so I have to catch up on these videos. As y'all can tell, I have a new office space that I moved into. You feel me? So the decorations and all that is dry. All right? So that's just a little disclaimer because I am I know y'all going to be like, yo, bro, like what happened to the, the background? You feel me? So, yeah, it's a lot of uh updates I'm trying to do. Um, for the channel, you know what I'm saying? It will be very, it will be more, you know what I'm saying? More. So, uh, yeah, Brimmy Ma asked for privacy and her time and need, you feel me? So, we about to watch that. We'll see what her song got to say about that. Before I press play on this video, though, subscribe to my channel. You heard, put your chest in it. You know what I'm saying? Smash that like button. Turn on your post notifications so y'all can get notified every time I drop a video. So, let's get right into this video right here. Shall we begin? Shall we begin? Let me read this real quick. Well, Remy, you had to say before I get into this topic. We stand by Jason. Oh, shout out to Remy. Yo, chill. Shout out to Remy with no makeup on right now, though. It looked like it. It looked like she don't got no makeup on. At all. You know what I'm saying? It's giving, it's giving nice, clean face. No makeup. You feel me? Glowing. I like that. That's that's dope. His innocence and pray that the NYPD will conduct a complete and thorough investigation to reveal the truth. This is undoubtedly a difficult time for my family and me. While we sincerely appreciate the love and support we have received from all of you, we kindly ask for privacy as our legal team worked to prove Jason's innocence. Mm. As his mother, I want to address the situation personally, but have been strongly advised by his legal counsel not to say anything, as most people in similar situations are informed by the attorneys due to being in an active case. Now, Wow, I just built the most amazing workflow on Monday.com. You build your own workflow? Why? There are a bunch of amazing pre-made templates you can just choose from. This situation right here is an ugly situation in so many levels. This is what happens. Like, when you sit back and you really, really analyze, and I used to always say to y'all, when you take a real nigga you take in, in, in a bad B-I-T-C-H and you put it together, this is what you get. A hood booger. A hood booger. This is what you get. See, my whole thing right here, for y'all to understand, Damn. this situation right here, it's personal. You want your privacy? Yo, he's going in on her. He called her a hood booger. I haven't heard a hood booger in dumb long, bro. That's OD old school. You don't deserve no <laughs> privacy, Remy. What privacy do you deserve? The people. We the people. We loved you, Remy. We love Pat. We put we put everything into your career. And your music, your lyrics, your lifestyle, your gangster persona gave birth to evil. And see the little evil bastard that you gave birth to? What did he do? Yo. He took with you the lifestyle that you glorified. The lifestyle that yo calling her son a bastard is crazy. <laughs> son of Hassan is crazy, bro. That glorified and he went. Bro, with what it. you know? Because some people they rap, but they keep their kids out of the street. Now let's keep it funky, right? I didn't know nothing about your son until yesterday when I found out he was the one being charged with killing my cousin's father, my cousin's baby father, oh. my little cousin's father. Yeah, so this gets. Oh, this shit hit home, bro. Now I understand why Hassan is on hots right now. This hit home, bro. Different. When you had to see your family cry and break down over a situation like this, and we all know D-Block loved his daughter. You want privacy? You don't deserve privacy. Your son does not deserve privacy. And I'll say he's innocent until proven guilty. But I, what I will also say is, prior to this, he was already locked up for a gun. For a gun. And yesterday, I had some conversations with some people that's in the streets that know your son. And Shorty's bout it, bout it. Makes no mistakes about it. Your son is bout it, bout it. You raised the terrorist. You had all the elements and all the tools. Yo, the funny thing is, how is he even in the streets, though? Because like, if he really bout it, bout it, bro, like, he literally grew up. Like, with no, with no, uh, I would say... I mean, okay, his mom's was in jail for dumb long, but I'm pretty sure the Papoose took care of the kids. You feel me? Like, I'm pretty sure Papoose made sure that them kids had anything they needed because he made sure Remy had anything she needed. So his reasoning to be in the streets is what? You feel me? And it's always the kids that get that has the money and and don't have to be in the streets want to be in the streets and it's always the kids that don't want to be in the streets end up going to jail or being or getting murdered you yeah. feel me because they have no choice 
but to be in the streets. Then he's got these celebrity kids get to go in the hood, chill in the hood, be act all hood and shit, and then go back and live in a mansion with their mother and father. That's crazy, but to make that boy become somebody, and you turn him into a hood bugger. He is the perfect example of when they say you can take a person out of the hood, but you can't take the hood out of them. Remy Ma is the epitome of everything that she spits out of her that's mouth. Crazy. And no, that's not Pat Poole's son, but Pat Poole's raised him. Right, like you raised Pat Poole's made sure he I good. What's he doing daughter? outside like that? Because if your son ended up in the bullpens, facing the rest of his life, getting ready to sit down with the judge and be judged by 12, with the lyrics that you spitting out of, their, out of your mouth and the way you carry yourself half naked on stage, what is your daughter going to be bobbing and weaving mics? It is what it is. At 3 o'clock, I'm going live on Snapbox TV because I have a lot to say and I'm just getting started. Y'all stay tuned. Hit that like button. Hit that share button. Hit that subscribe button. This video is too short because I got way more to say. I'm out. Yeah, I'm about to stop it right there because I already know he's about to promote his man's and shit. But um, yeah, nah, I, I definitely feel her son, bro. He's speaking facts, facts though, bro. Like, yo, like, how will her son be in this predicament though, bro? Like, you literally, yo, it, it just it just really irks me with these celebrity kids, yo. Like, they don't know how good they got it. You know what I'm saying? They don't know how mind you, we don't all right. So I, I, let me I'm gonna play devil's devil's advocate. We don't know. The, the what happened all right exactly maybe he had to defend himself maybe you feel me i gotta look more into the situation but just the fact that um you know what i'm saying that happened is 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 crazy to me bro like yo let me tell you something bro if my my parents are superstars bro what am i doing chilling in the hood for for what if i'm not coming to the hood to to bring back or like um you know, give back to the community and show the community, like, yo, like, this This is what you could do, you know what I'm saying? Like, this is this is the type of lifestyle you could live, you feel me? Like, what am I coming back for? What, to rub it in everybody's face that I'm living better than them? You feel me? That I could still be street and I could be hard and I could be hood and still live a, a, a luxury life? I just, I really just don't get it. That shit really irks me, bro, like, like for real, I wonder. I wonder really. I wonder what Remy is thinking. Like, yo, like, damn, did did I fail this kid as a mother? Like, did me, did me, like, is she thinking like me being locked up for so long really uh, traumatized my kids? And now look at him; he's about to be booked. Like, like I don't know. Hopefully that he didn't do it, and you feel me. And it's just you know what I'm saying uh, a messed up situation. But we'll find out. Um. You know what I mean? In the days to come. I appreciate y'all watching this video. Before I head out, though, subscribe to my channel. If you heard, put your chest in it. You know what I'm saying? Smash that like button. Turn on your post notifications. And I'll see y'all on the next video or in the comment section. Let's get it.